me wish all our mothers a very happy feast. This is a small message, not for the mothers, but for the others. If you want to see the significance of a mother in one's life, in the life of a family, you need to go to that house where there is no mother. Go to a house where there is no woman and see the house. Just observe. There is so much of disorder. There is so much of chaos. Clothes are thrown here and there. Vessels and the plates are unwashed in the kitchen. So much of dirt and filth in the corners and things are all displaced. In one word, the whole house is in a mess. Go to a house where there is a woman, where there is a mother, there is order, there is brightness, the children can smile and laugh. The spark of hope in the eyes of the young. There is certain amount of order everywhere. Things are in its place. Rates and the vessels are washed and kept in their own places. And once we have seen this, I don't think we need to speak more about a woman. Where there is a woman, where there is a mother, there is life. Where there is no mother, there is darkness, dullness and lack of life. The mother is the one who gives birth to life, sustains life and finally helps life grow. May this life ever grow. That was the dream of Jesus. That I have come that you may have life and life in its fullness. He said. That the mothers of today promote this life in all of us. And finally, we are grateful to our mothers who keep life going and growing. Thank you. Congratulations and jubilations I want the